Hello everyone. My name is Shweta Upadhyay and today I welcome you all to this session on creating a portfolio using Linktree in lesser amount of time. A little bit about myself. So I started my web development journey using simple landing pages and web applications by HTML, CSS, JavaScript, Bootstrap and some themes based on Bootstrap. Gradually, I migrated towards more complex web architectures and designed and developed them using React, Node, Vue, and other JavaScript frameworks. I also have knowledge in project management, Git, and GitHub. Apart from that, I also design logos, images for the websites. So, before diving into how we create a portfolio, let us know what is a portfolio. You can take a portfolio as your identity card that you will be presenting to your employer showcasing a proper like well designed and appealing showcasing of your works experiences projects that you have done designs you have made or whatever blogs you have written and so on you can take it as a gallery like we have a gallery of pictures you also have gallery of songs where we see the listing of songs so you can think of it as that please note portfolio is very important in today's industry no matter whether you are a student or a working professional having proper showcasing of your talents is very very important so next question that comes to your mind is yes we'll be designing a portfolio but why actually should we at all take the headache of designing a portfolio so like i mentioned portfolio you can take it as a professional passport an identity it will unlock Poss huge possibilities for you like a lot of opportunities can be unlocked by just building an appealing portfolio why is that because your portfolio will not only have your experiences written in plain pen and paper it will have visual images it will showcase how you have actually done what you have actually done and people can as visualize like okay this person has created this website in this possible way and he or she can do it in this possible way that's the choice of colors they have utilized and so on and by giving your portfolio by having a portfolio you can just say to your employer like look that's my talent that's the skills i possess this is how i work and this is what i can bring to the organization if you hire so this in all gives you more attention and you make you a better candidate in comparison to other applicants all right so let's get started with linktree and how we will actually build a portfolio using linktree so once you open linktree in google you will get a screen like this you can just google search it or you can refer to the links which i have shared in the description section for your reference now you have to claim your link tree so you will just give your name you can either give just your first name or you can just include your entire name and then click claim your link tree. now after you click on this it will ask you to enter your mail id and some other details and then it will send you a verification mail like when you click on this email the verification link that will be sent to your email it will ask you to activate your free account please note using this simple steps you will get a free version of the account right so once you activate your account you will be taken to a list of questions by linktree say describe yourself what kind of work you do what industry you belong to and how you will be using this kind of portfolio it could be a professional portfolio it could be related to marketing it could be related to your like professional portfolio of software maybe pharmacy and so on you might be a student as well so you can also specify that as well in your question so it depends entirely on linktree and the question is that you answer so once you answer all these questions you will be taken to the admin dashboard where you will be able to see a lot of options and you can design your own portfolio as well as add the relevant links okay so after logging in you will get an admin dashboard which will have certain sections which will help you to design integrate and present the way you want your portfolio to look like you can always get a visual output whatever changes you make it will be reflected immediately and a personalized link will also be created by linktree for you please note while creating your account you would have been asked whether you want a free account or a paid account there is always an option to upgrade depending upon your requirements so you can always go for a free account for a beginner level 
but if you need some extra features you can always go for a paid pro or other versions as shared by link link right so in pre versions most of the facilities are actually included which are necessary for a portfolio but like i mentioned if you need something extra always go for pro right so after logging in you can see this is the admin dashboard it has four sections of links appearances analytics and settings this one is a showcasing of your link like how it will look like once you are adding each element one by one the design and everything is customizable and if you can see this is fully responsive if you want to see on a bigger screen you can just click open my link tree and it will open it here and you can see this is my link tree and i can visualize it in a proper and see this is the dedicated link which has been created based on the username which i provided to claim my link tree account okay so let's see you can add links from here so basically you can add any kinds of links most of the links present over here are in free versions like snapchat thread if you are like community person you can also start a community or a subscribe section you can also add linkedin github and everything please note you also can add a contact form where people can enter their details and like Uh, potential clients could contact you by writing their details, email ID, and everything. And once you set up the contact form and provide the email ID as per your choice, you will get that message directly into your mailbox. This everything is included in free part of link. Another important thing is this contact details. So you are also asking people about their contact details once they visit your website. But people will also like to know your details once they visit your website. So this particular link will. ask you for your personal like options like your name phone number email id and other things as per necessity and it will kind of generate a downloadable contact card where people who are viewing your site can actually view that okay this is a visiting card a software visiting card of this person and i'll just download it so you can say it's just a software version of what we have the modern day visiting cards okay you can also add your social media accounts like snapchat whatsapp and other things so in this way you can continue with all the links so for my case i have added here you can see linkedin github youtube and so on so this is how i have added it let's close this one yeah so there is this for linkedin you can change the header if you want you can also write connect me or welcome to my linkedin profile and so on that flexibility is there you put your link please note this icons that i have put is also changeable okay you can also change the icon you can choose like you can if you are a designer you make your own icons then you can upload your own or you can choose from the icons that are available from linktree directly okay and similarly github is there youtube is there and everything is there now for resume you can add resume cover letter or everything here i have added resume so thumbnail you can put then document you can upload from here you can add more documents and you can also add a description like what will be shown to the people who will be viewing this job you can add this contact me form which i was talking about so this will have a list of fields okay see contact type form okay so it will you can add name you can make whichever are required and whichever are not required so here i'll just make the country required as well and see this one is the mail id i have put here and you can always get the mails sent there you can always put a custom message a description as per your need so this is how you can add all your links through this section now let's see how we can design like we can like the background the buttons and everything through this so you have to click on the appearance section to the admin dashboard to be able to actually design your link so once it's loaded let's see how it looks like okay please remember that you have to add a professional image over here you cannot add selfie or any other thing it has to be something very professional all right you can upload your image by clicking on pick an image or you can remove it if you do not want to put any image but i'll suggest you should put a image which is actually very impressive when whenever any person or any potential recruiter looks into this website you can give your name as the title then you can add a short bio about yourself say you are not a software person you may be working in a pharmacy related field or you may be working in automobile field or you may be working as a writer as a freelancer anything or a youtuber you can just add small words with emojis or without emojis to make it look professional so that whenever any person is opening your website he can get a glimpse what you are actually into 
all right from here you can add the social media icons which i have added for here instagram and email you can add whatsapp and there are lot of other options which you can add please add that this icons may not appear only at bottom you can also put them at top but it is always advisable to put it at the bottom because that is how the structure of any portfolio in general looks like people are more accustomed to look in for this kind of social medias at the end and not at the very beginning okay so now getting the design so there are some ready made designs of all the buttons as well as the background which are provided for free there are some which need to be paid so you need to upgrade to be able to access this but it is always good if you can go with free ones because these are very simple and sophisticated ones so for my case i have chosen this background because it's a little creative and gives a good clean ui kind of appeal to any person who will be viewing you can also choose custom designing where you can design your own background you can put a solid color completely or you can put a gradient you are always welcome to choose the color you can also design your this box is the links buttons you can also design them they can be curved rectangle a little less curved or a little more curved you can add shadows and whatever and whatever you add buttons buttons font or shadow you can also customize the color from here you can also choose a single font for the entire portfolio and the color also now if you want to remove this link tree logo like you can see at the bottom you will get a link tree logo as you can see here right so if you want to remove this logo or this advertisement kind of a thing you can just upgrade or if you keep it it does not give any harm okay so now the next thing is analytics analytics basically gives you a glimpse of how many views your profile actually had how many times any link in your profile say github or anything was clicked and like how people are actually engaging with your website through the link so that is about it this is how you can basically get create started with creating the portfolio by adding the links designing applications and so on so let us see you can also share your qr for link tracing it is also available profile picture is also available so let's click on this one and see what will happen if you want to view in a bigger screen because many people work with laptops and many people would like to see your profile on mobile itself so that is the main reason why linktree has by default proper responsive outline for you so you do not need to work hard on making anything responsive like we have to do in case of any design that we do from scratch so this is how it will look like finally you'll have all the buttons you'll have your profile you'll have your description and everything in ready in one place and you will have a dedicated link created for you so clicking on this link will be able to navigate you can see link is coming here from where we can navigate and then the resume section will show your resume document that you uploaded through the admin dashboard and people will be able to get a view of it you can also see there is a share option see the document is loading so it takes time to load but it will showcase everything and you can view this well. there is the contact me form and the fields that you selected will automatically get reflected see country is required now it has come and these are fields need to be filled up before any person wants to send a message to you through this okay so that is about it this is how you get started with creating your portfolio in lesser amount of time using linktree's free version so i hope you like the video if you want more details about how to create your portfolio i have a blog published for you the link is there in the description section you can go through this blog and you will have a step by step detailed description of how you can create the portfolio what all steps you need to take in case you miss out on any steps you can always come back to the video and see it see these are the plans that are available you can always go for plans that you want or you can go for free versions which have the access and this is described equally and linking websites everything is shown so that's about it i hope you like the video if you like the video do not forget to give a like please subscribe to my channel for more such contents and hope you will enjoy building your own portfolio if so share your portfolio links in the comment sections and stay connected stay safe stay healthy thank you so much for listening